Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see, I'm missing something on my face. I'm missing my eye wigs. So as for my title, I'm going to show you guys how to do your eyelashes. Simple, easy steps that are obviously easy to do. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So when it comes to eyelashes, normally eyelashes, um, they don't come custom made for a specific eye shape or eye size. So they all, they all just one size, and you have to custom them on your own. To do that, what you will need, um, a pair of tiny scissors. You could use a, um, what's this called? Come on, what is it called? Um. A tweezer a tweezer you might need a tweezer if you find it difficult to use your hands or an eyelash applicator that looks like something like this obviously you need eyelash glue I'm using the one from duo and a pair of lashes Aisha Jahangir lashes in the style Alia I'm gonna remove one pair of the lash just taking my Tweezer. I usually use my fingers. So I'm gonna be using a tweezer to remove the lashes from its case. Just grabbing the end and gently peeling it off. If you peel the lash off from its case um, wrongly, you're gonna destroy the hairs over here. You're gonna destroy the band itself. It's gonna break. So you always have to be careful. If you're gonna be using your hands just try and peel off from the end not from the middle otherwise you're just gonna break it apart so eyelashes come with this extra band over here if you, if you can see on the end of both sides you have to cut that extra band from your eyelashes because if you don't it's gonna start poking you and you're gonna feel uncomfortable throughout the time you're gonna wear your lashes and you just don't want that be careful you do not cut off the hair, just the end of the band that is excess. If your eyelashes do not have that, then you do not have to cut it off. Okay. So after cutting the excess band on your lashes, step 2 is to size your lashes according to your eye size. So you're going to take your lashes either with the applicator or your tweezer or your fingers whatever you're comfortable with so what you want to do is look down I repeat when you want to put your eyelashes on you look down and not forward and not upwards <laughs> you obviously can't look upwards like no okay so you have to look downwards. let me zoom you guys in for this step two not that close <laughs> okay I'm gonna take my lash, my mirror, you're gonna put your eyelashes from your inner corner first where your eyelashes would supposedly start growing right over here if you can see you're not gonna put them here because we, we don't really have hair that shows over here so where it starts showing which is here so I'm gonna take my lash and I'm gonna put from there all the way to the end and as you can see oh, come on stop staying and if I had an excess eyelash it would be coming all the way out on this side this one you have to cut you have to cut it off and when you when your eyelashes are too big for your eyes where you cut is is not from the inner corner you do not touch that part apart from cutting the excess band you do not touch anything else from there i repeat you do not touch anything apart from the excess band from the inner corner side of your eyelashes where you want to cut is the outer corner which is this side where the hairs are too long i hope you can see because it's not focusing so where you want to cut is the outside part where your eyelashes are too long which is this side over here and when you want to cut you cut a little bit at a time you don't want to go cut a huge chunk and then you just have your eyelashes pulled and then you have to try and resize it all over again cutting the excesses that's a whole different level and yeah so i'm gonna cut just a little bit just a little bit 
you know because it's not that um big for my eyes because I, I got pretty big eyes so that much just like two four strands and I'm gonna size it again remember after cutting your eyelashes you're gonna size it again just to make sure that it's perfect for your eyes so again from where I'm gonna put to uh, so again I'm gonna put and that's perfect for my eyes so step three get your eyelash glue if you have the one that has a brush that is a good one you that's like easily um usable you're just gonna apply it on the band of your eyelashes and you're good to go but but if you have this one i suggest you to squeeze um a little bit on the back of your hand or on your table wherever that you wish squeeze it out take a brush use the end side of the brush dip it in your glue just like that and you're gonna apply to the um, band right over here where I'm applying and remember in makeup a little bit goes a long way so you want to start with less glue and then build it up if it's not enough so right after applying my um, glue I'm gonna let my eyelash glue um, dry a little bit get tacky in the meantime I'm gonna go in with my mascara you always want to do your mascara um, before putting on your lashes because when you put on your lashes and then your mascara and then you're gonna pull off your lashes or it's all gonna be all sticky and all that mess you just don't want to go through that so while it's drying get your mascara and apply it get your lashes prepped If your eyelashes are naturally um, straight and not curved, like I suggest you use an eyelash curler that will make your eyelashes curl and it'll be easier to blend in with your first la fourth lashes. The la the mascara that I use is from NARS. Um, it's the Audacious, Audacious Audacious mascara in the shade Black Moon. So while my mascara is drying my lashes, I'm just drying, I'm just gonna check on my lashes. They look pretty dry to me. So I'm gonna zoom you guys in again, looking downwards so that I could see properly everything. So when I'm looking downwards, I'm gonna put now when you're putting your eyelashes on, you do not put it straight way. Because if you put it like that straight, you are, it's gonna stay this way, and then that's gonna look like um, you have an umbrella over your eyes, which is not what you want. You want it to be curved up, look like you have your nice beautiful eye wigs. You know, I hope you get what I'm trying to say. So you're not going to put it straight, but you're going to put it this way. So they look facing upwards. So looking down, starting from my inner corner, laying it down. And then sticking to, not on my eyelashes, but on my lash line. I'm just gonna pull a little bit here. Never mind. If you're not able to start sticking from your inner corner first, you can start putting it on the middle. Just measure it and then put it on the middle. And then you can come to your inner corner and then finish out with the outer side. Once I've laid my eyelashes, I'm going to take my fingertips and I'm just going to press them against my natural eyelashes to blend them in and make sure they're secured. And voila! That's how big of a difference fake eyelashes will make. You know? like get up with my natural and then with my eyelashes you know my eye wigs i like calling them eye wigs because they're like wigs for your eyes i'm just gonna take in my mascara again just to make sure my eyelashes blend pretty well 
I'm gonna lightly apply it on my false lashes and my natural lashes. And that's it for today guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed filming it. So, and um, actually learned something from it because it was really fun. Putting lashes is not really easy but with practice you can get to that, um, to that level where it will become easy for you. So if you guys enjoyed watching this video, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't heard it. Like, what are you waiting for? <laughs> I don't understand. What are you waiting for? Like, honestly, subscribe. Like, I won't judge you if you want, but please subscribe. You know, help us this out. <laughs> and if you guys would like a tutorial on this simple look that I did over here, um, I, this is my go-to look for whatever I'm going, whatever function that I'll be going. This is the look that I usually go for. I just change the lips and under um lower liner color and that's pretty much it so if you guys would like to know how i got this look over here just let me know in my comment box below and i'll film that one the next time i upload a youtube video hopefully soon so and i'd like to thank you guys for watching my tutorial see you guys on my next one